You touched on a good point with the, the amount of graduates that would graduate from state institutions from around the Midwest that move to Chicago or outlying suburbs, yet there seems to be a move statewide to defund our state university system. And it's terrible. And I've been visiting these campuses. I've, I, I've been to Carbondale. Mike Henry is a mayor of Carbondale and a friend. He is a Republican who uh, went to Carbondale, graduated, started a printing business, became a Republican, head of the Chamber of Commerce, head of the search committee to find a mayoral candidate. When he couldn't find one, they said, you're going to be the mayor. Mike's the mayor. And we talked about what the budget crisis in Springfield did to Carbondale. They have, on average, about 50 homes for sale at any given time. Now they have 250. And the reason is this absolute decline in confidence about the future of the university brought on by the budget crisis. Enrollment went down, faculty members left, administrators were fired, and they're wondering, what's tomorrow going to be like? Then I went to Macomb and it's the same story it, it, with Western Illinois University. And they're struggling to wonder what the future is going to be. What that budget crisis did was to you really strike some fear in their hearts about whether they could survive this thing. That's not only hurting the universities, it's hurting the towns where these universities are located. They're the major drivers, if not of the economy, of the spirit of that community. So we wonder why we lose so many high school grads in Illinois who go off to other places. Part of it is because we've stopped investing in our universities.